Actually, the white suit has nothing to do with the uniform of a Kentucky colonel. It's just something Uncle Harley made more popular and that more Kentucky colonels today that want to impersonate him dress like. The Kentucky colonels have been around since 1813. Technically, that is the uniform of a Kentucky colonel. Early Kentucky colonels actually served in military roles, but in the late 1800s, it became more ceremonial, the honorary role, leading all the way up to Governor Ruby Lafoon. In the late 1920s, a group of colonels started talking about forming a society. Governor Flem Sampson gave his blessings to the project, and late one Saturday afternoon in May of 1931, the first meeting of what would eventually become the Kentucky Colonels was held in Frankfurt. There's a lot of history, and all of it can be found in the link in my bio, because you go to kycolonels.org and click the History tab, and you can read all about it. When Uncle Harley became a Kentucky Colonel, he was actually commissioned twice. 1935, Governor Ruby Lafoon commissioned him. A few years later, he would be commissioned again. By his second commission is when he started taking the role more seriously, and he started wearing the facial hair and dressing like this. However, the white suit came because he got flower stains on his black suit. It was more of a Kentucky gentleman look, and the white suit covered the flower stains. The white suit actually has no role in Kentucky colonels. Ironically, neither does chicken. 